So you've been elected president. It's your first day in the Situation Room. What three questions do you ask your national security experts about the world? What we want to do, when we want to do it, and how hard do we want to hit? Because we are going to have to hit very, very hard to knock out ISIS. We're going to also have to learn who our allies are. We have allies, so-called allies. We're spending billions and billions of dollars supporting people. We have no idea who they are in Syria. Do we want to stay that route, or do we want to go and make something with Russia? I hate to say Iran, but with Russia, because we made in the Iran deal, it's one of the worst deals I've ever seen negotiated in my entire life. It's a disgrace that this country negotiated that deal. But very important, <laughs> not only a disgrace, it's a disgrace and an embarrassment, but very important, who are we fighting with? Who are we fighting for? What are we doing? We have to rebuild our country. But we have to, I'm the only one on the stage that said, do not go into Iraq. Do not attack Iraq. Nobody else on this stage said that. And I said it loud and strong. And I was in the private sector. I wasn't a politician, fortunately. But I said it, and I said it loud and clear. You'll destabilize the Middle East. That's exactly what happened. I also said, by the way, four years ago, three years ago, attack the oil. Take the wealth away. Attack the oil and keep the oil. They didn't listen. They just started that a few months ago. Senator Rubio.